keeping satisfied through the weekend. You were like nine to five on the weekend. Make him lose his mind every weekend. You take Wednesday, Thursday, and just send him my way. Think I got it covered for the weekend. Hey guys, I am moving today, and I'm sitting on the floor of my bed frame. That's empty. Don't ask why, I just am. It's a very Jordan thing to do. So, I'm doing very Jordan things. <sighs> I also feel a very lot of stress, a very lot, a whole lot of stress, because I am moving today by myself. If I talk about why, I'll probably cry. So I'm not even gonna go there. Let's just say I got a whole lot of shit to move, and it's 7 a.m. I woke up at 6. I packed some stuff, but I'm a terrible packer, y'all, so I'm just trying to, like, work through getting stuff in something so it can be moved to my next apartment. So it's just been a ugh, ugh, ugh kind of yesterday and today, especially since I'm so frustrated about moving by myself. But you know, it's okay. I end up hiring movers. So we're gonna get this done. And it's 8 a.m. now. Movers will be here at 9. So I got some more shit to try and put somewhere so it can be transported. So happy moving day to me, I suppose. And I, in this video, I plan on showing you guys my empty luxury apartment tour, the apartment that I'm moving from. I am downsizing, downgrading. I don't really know if I'm downsizing, but I'm definitely downgrading in all areas of my life because I got to get my coins right. So I'm going to show y'all my luxury apartment and I'm going to show y'all where I'm moving to. And y'all can judge me. Y'all could do whatever you please. But it's, this is for me, okay? Self-care is important. And self-care means taking care of your finances. So, that's what Jordan Ari is going to do. I'm going to take care of me and my finances. And downgrade in all aspects of my life so I can do the things that I really want to do. So, I hope you guys enjoy my empty apartment tour. My new apartment probably won't be an empty apartment tour. It's going to be whatever furniture and however I get it in there today. And what it looks like on moving day. Because this is a moving day video, really. But, you know kind of want to throw in how I'm moving from luxury to basic college life apartment style housing so yeah I hope you guys enjoyed the video be sure to subscribe and I don't know what else I got to say but I'm gonna turn on some music and dance I keep singing SZA the weekend so maybe I'll listen to SZA okay I'll see you guys later I gotta figure this stuff out I got an hour Lord bless me pray for me Send your prayers. We'll let you know if I make it. Hopefully that's enough. Okay, bye. apartment but I'm not sad about cutting my rent price in half no 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 the feeling is reckless I'm knowing I'm selfish knowing I'm desperate getting all in and I'm falling all over love I do it to the last pass I ain't gonna do bad but I'm for your life like is you is kind of dirty how intense are you supposed to clean before you move in a part in move out in apartment because I mean I live a clean life like I clean regularly but like I showered the past few days I'm not washing the tub out is that wrong of me is that trifling let me know let me know I want to know if I'm being trifling I mean I don't really care but please let me know what do you do 
houses. I'm really just bored talking. <laughs> Waiting for these movers at this point. Guys, I'm in my new apartment. I am about to take Milo out because he keeps crying. But I'm also like exhausted. This day has taken so much out of me. More than I thought that it was going to take. And yeah. I can show you guys the new house. So you come in. There's a closet right here. There's an awkward little opening right here. This is a wall. There's an opening. Excuse my stuff everywhere. And I plan on filming and stuff over here in this nook, which is pretty nice. So it's like off to the side. It's like a dining room, but I don't have that dining room stuff. Milo, I promise. Okay, maybe I should take him out. And Nope, I'm going to do this because this is going to be fast. And then this is like the living room. Little couch. Over there is the balcony. This is just a furnace closet. And then we have my kitchen with all this junk everywhere I need to unpack. And my bedroom, which is so much smaller. My comforter is in the washer at my old place. I'm about to go get it once I leave here. And then my mirror, closet. It's a nice big walk-in closet, thank God. My clothes, shoes, racks up there, racks down there, racks on racks on racks. So, nice big closet. And then my bathroom. I hate that noise. They're going to change these lights in here because I don't like them. They're way too dim and I don't like warm lights. But here's my bathroom. I'm so excited that this... New apartment comes with a huge tub again. And then it's like a long counter. So it's like a long counter and then there's this little opening right here which is nice. I think I'm gonna set up my makeup here so that I have the mirror and my makeup little station. This is probably what I'm gonna turn into like a vanity. And then here is where the washer and dryer would go. But because I'm downgrading in all aspects of my life, there's not a washer and dryer because my friend lives down the street and is going to let me wash at her house. So that's just the life I'm going to live. And that's what happens when you decide to downsize in all areas of your life. So just kind of is what it is. White appliances. What is this yellowish wood? It's not my favorite. Like this is not what my home's gonna look like. But I had to realize that I do not own this place. When I own my place, I can have it as nice and decked out as I can afford. But right now I am renting and I need to be scraping my coins so that I can do what I really wanna do, which is start my own business and travel. So that's the motive right now. This is what I'm on. Nowhere trying to keep up. I'm trying to keep up with Jordan and not the Joneses. So yeah, I'm living this little life right now. But I'm about to take Milo out and go to my other apartment and get the other stuff out. And then I can show you guys the apartment I just moved from, which is so beautiful. I'm so sad I miss it already, but it's okay. I feel good and I feel at home here. Once I get everything situated, everything unpacked, I'll feel a lot better, but... Yeah, at least I was able to clean and wipe down some stuff. You guys see I got my Clorox right there. Yeah, it's a little wipe down, so that's taken care of. But yeah, done talking. Milo's tired of me and needs to go to the bathroom. Okay, this whole not getting into a warm car thing because it's been sitting outside in the freezing cold. Yeah, this is going to take some getting used to. God, and it's so cold, guys. It's been minus all week, and right now it says 12, but I think that's just because the sun is beaming on my car. You guys probably think that I abuse Milo. He's just been crying, 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 but he hates the car, especially when I put him in the back seat. But my hands were full, so he had to go in the back. And now he's up here on my, front, on my lap, in the front, looking at the, out the window, where he loves to be. So now he's happy. Hopefully no more crying Milo. Alright, I'm about to take this trek back to my old house which is 35 minutes away. 
So we're entering from my garage. The empty apartment tour. You come into the left and there is a closet. I'm gonna miss this place. And then you walk directly into the kitchen. I love this granny. I love the deep sinks. I love the faucet, how it stretches. My island. I love these lights. I love how there's so much light that comes in from all these windows and even the door. And then there are lights up here. I don't think these are recess lights, but whatever they are, I fool with them. There's so much cabinet space. My fridge, freezer, and it has the water filter on it. I love that. This is a huge pantry. I'm gonna miss this because my pantry now is kinda small. But a huge pantry. All of this space. In here is like a little sunroom. I had big plans for this sunroom, but the price of this apartment just didn't allow for it. And then there was a powder room. Hey sis. And this bedroom, which is so huge in comparison to the bedroom that I'm in now. And so much light comes in through this window, which Oh my gosh, I love, but my room now still has a lot of light coming in through it. The bathroom mirror. Well, I think we started this video. Nope, we started on the floor. I tried to start in here, but that didn't go so well. So this bathroom, I love the bathroom. I have a wide tub still, so I'm happy, but I had a really nice wide tub and I love this subway tile. And, oh my gosh, I'm going to miss this shower head. You were a dream. And you see those, wa those, let me zoom in for y'all. You see that? Yeah, that is because the water in Indianapolis is so bad. It has so much residue left over. And then my huge closet, which I'm so thankful I still have a big closet. And I loved this feature. I had my washer and dryer in my closet it was so amazing and i'm definitely going to miss having my garage attached to my house because getting in a cold car is not what i'm into but i'm so happy to be out of this home i loved it i feel connected to it a bit because it's my first on my own home like once I left college and entered the real world, so I feel a little bit connected to it there, but I'm so excited for my new home and all of my cost savings. I am saving over half, over half of what I paid here at my new place. And I still have a huge closet. I still have a huge bathroom. My room's not as big and I don't have as much living room space. Well, I actually might still have as much living room space. It's just kind of set up differently. There might be a little less though. And I'm paying a fraction of the price. So I'm just thankful for that. And I'm thankful for getting my priority straight in 2018. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video, seeing like what I'm going from, like downgrading from my luxury. Like, look at this. Look at the frame of this mirror downgrading from my luxury apartment into my basic post like college life apartment and you know it's okay it's gonna be a journey and i am unapologetically sharing with you guys and i hope that you enjoyed this video give it a thumbs up if you did subscribe to my channel and i'll see you guys in my next upload until next time peace milo's about to pounce on my feet watch I knew it. <laughs> he wants to play. He wants to play in our empty apartment door. <sighs> I think Milo's a bit sad that we're leaving this house, but you'll be alright, bud.